everyone, new ammo here for more of our XCOM Not So Long War. And what we're. I appreciate okay, I'm pressing all sorts of wrong buttons. So, what well, we're gonna be. decided to prioritize here. We need more satellites. We need more fighters. And we're gonna put satellites and continents we have fighters stationed already because more efficient use for our limited number of fighters. So, we're gonna be focusing on North America and Asia. As well as maybe a couple in Africa, although they're not very, they're not going to give us much money for that. So we need money for satellite uplinks and satellites. Everything else should be, we're still producing our lasers, right? Yeah, laser rifles. We do have satellites being built, we don't have the satellite uplink facility yet because I ran out of money. I forgot about that because I'm bad. I'm just, I'm just not very good at keeping track of that. I need like an accountant to help me out. Now I spend my money. Alright, we're... How much does a satellite uplink cost? Satellite uplink costs two hundred dollars, so we almost have enough. Our fission generator will be completed. So we should have two hundred dollars in ten days. We should do a mission, get some money, and have enough money for a satellite uplink. Sectoid corpses for scientists? Sure. I don't think we use sectoid corpses for things. I'm not positive. I don't think we do. Alien abductions. Commander, Swarming in Mexico. In How'd that happen? We have a satellite there. We're supposed to see these things. So we need to dispatch to Tijuana. Alright, let's go. And our good sniper looks like. We gotta make items available. Right. You don't really need a scope. We'll give you one anyway. Gunner, use a scope. Do we have? Are we like sending out the A team here? No, it looks like it's a mix. You have some high level, some higher level guys, and some low level guys. That's fine. I think. I hope that's fine. You also need a scope. So you're gonna be shooting a lot. You have the heat ammo, so you're gonna be targeting our those uh drones and the, what are the seekers that we can never hit? Do we really only have privates, otherwise. Yeah, everyone else is fatigued. And our privates suck. We need to hire new soldiers just to get better privates. Why even just send one of the robots? Yeah, it's swarming. I don't like just sending these this many privates. Send the robot. I don't think we have any any bonuses for him now. Nah. So we'll just send the robot. You guys need your alien trophies. And your aim boosters, because you're all terrible. You have low stat points, just all around. And hopefully we don't die. That's a, mostly these three, the corporals and the lieutenant. Those are most important. I don't care about the shiv, I don't care about the privates. I'm gonna try not to get them killed, but if they do die, we're not gonna we're not gonna panic. I think it's the best we got, let's go. Swarming, we did $150, which helped a lot. And also, panic reduction would be super awesome. Dropship has arrived. Also, how can we... We're going to be putting down These aircraft we have are so ridiculously fast. The aliens are continuing to target civilians for abduction in several major cities across the... Do we only have one Sky Ranger? Let me know. Kind of just wash over the Sky Ranger. Alright, in this map, I usually, I historically do not do well on this map. You're a robot, you're not going to take cover. I don't have any foundry upgrades for it, our uh, robot. Let's just go slow. Okay, nothing out here. That are... Yeah, I was gonna say, is that the lieutenant bonus? It is. She has her. Or all the units have their post battle fatigue reduced by one day. Which is alright. Maybe I should have taken the other bonus, but I usually take the will boosting options anyway, so I no, don't think it's a big deal. I want our sniper ready to get in that building. Maybe shoot out this window. Oh, don't know where you're gonna go. Did you get a post up here as well? 
And Robit. You can just hang out in the middle. Overwatch. O Overwatch. No one else Overwatch. Take this nice and slow. We'll be fine. I'm pretty sure last time I tried to take this nice and slow, we died anyway. We're gonna take this extra slow. Peek out this window. Nothing out there. Marcus, you get to peek over here. Down the floaters. There's a lot of floaters going on. I'm uncomfortable with that number of floaters. One of you has better aim. 70. 68. There. And there. I'm gonna get there. Uh, robot. You prepare to flank them. Nice and fast. Pretty sure it has decent aim. Yeah, 70. That's alright. It's immune to criticals. That's good too. Do you have any alright shots? Actually, yeah, you do. 62%. Toss a decent grenade. Not really at all. Ah, those grenades are not good shots. 62 though. Take that guy. And you missed. Remember, you can't be missing like that. And you hunker down so you don't get hit. Because you're the officer, we need you to not die. Very important. Our private, here's a chance to shine. Alright. That you messed it up, but it's alright. I mean we'll we'll be okay. A lot of overwatch. A lot of ooh, that's a very aggressive move. <laughs> a lot of overwatch. Wow, okay, they're all on overwatch. Yes, I know there's meld over there. I don't really care. We have other things to deal with right now. A nice grenade. Yes, Granata. Granata out. Can't really. Don't have much. Much room to maneuver in here. I'd really like to take out this guy right there. He's creating some problems for us. Oh, we can't see it from there, but we can see it from back here. Sniper, what kind of shots do you have? 59. 97. Okay, well, we yeah, just have to take that. At least kill one of these guys. And that doesn't really have much to go. And Overwatch. Overwatch. 42 is not great. If we injure it, ah, if we hit that, that would be, that would be big. That would be really nice. Now this thing has a good shot, and our some of our soldiers there, particularly Weber. These guys are soldiers are really aggressive. Yeah, Shiv, get it. Ah, oh, Shiv. We don't need upgrades for the Shivs. I can't expect it to be take, taking out everything. Guys, how many times have we shot this one floater and missed? Floaters are just impossible to hit. It's right on top of you. Thank you. That's two of them down. Our ship can help take care of that guy. Now you're right in front of it. You just pew pew. We didn't actually kill it. That is annoying. That's right. Private can come take the okay. take the glory. Guess that actually worked out better because our private got a kill instead of the robot. Not just this guy. Sniper should be able to take him out, right? There we go. All right, got that squad done without any. Any casualties? 
get everyone all loaded up and ready to go. And there's still another floater. How about there's more floaters? No, it's like a whole other squad of floaters right there. Yep, here they are. Yeah, let's... Oh, so many floaters! Oh no! That's what happened last time. <laughs> there was just a horde of floaters and they overran us. Robot! Get, in, get over here, right? Oh, I thought those were already triggered. Oh, and they weren't, so I just probably just killed us. That's, that's actually really bad. Might need to fall back. 89 though, that's a pretty good shot. I really wish our gunner here had some shots. Squad sight that guy. Oh, good, good shooting. There you go, we take a couple of them out this turn. It's increasing my confidence levels here. You can actually get around this side. You need to reload. I'd like her to move up here, but it's going to be too easy for them to flank her if she moves there. I'd really like her, yeah, just being a better spot to shoot. She can't get anywhere full cover. That it's not easy to flank. Unless I just have her trade off with Weber here. I guess wouldn't be the worst thing ever. Yeah, she has better aim, a more powerful weapon. Guy didn't die though. That's nah, a shame. Don't know what they're. Oh, I shouldn't robot. That's fine. We can. That's just a little bit of money. Just take out Shen right there. Be a hero. Be a hero. You're a hero. You get a commendation for this. Fantastic job, Shen. Alright, shoot the robot. It's fine, they can't crit the robot, which is like the biggest thing the robot is uh, hardened. They can't hit it for a ton of damage and destroy it, apparently, though. But it's fine. Shift down, we can live without a shift. D8, 65, that's pretty good. You just can't see anything from there. How can you. This window is not proving to be particularly effective. I don't think those, any of them are in Overwatch. Out. Here goes a little better, better line of sight for us. If I move there, oh, there's this guy there, I don't want to move up here. Is that a new, that's not a new squad, right? No, that's a dead guy, he's dead, it's just his engines are just running, okay. Get there and you grenade these guys. All of them. Try to take out the cover. That's what these grenades are for. Oh, beautiful job. You're a hero. Now we have our pick of who we want to kill. This guy's highest chance to not miss. Good job. And I guess we just overwatch because those guys can't see anyone. 68's good. Dig it. Missed anyway. Can't move anywhere better, so you also watch. Oh! Oh, where'd you come from? Oh, good thing you moved twice! <laughs> yes, yes, Weber, I know you're panicking. You, I understand why. I'm not gonna blame you for it. Oh, now he's being suppressed. That's really unfortunate. Alright, well, this turn just got. This just got pretty intense. Are you not going to overwatch? It's right there! Isn't that what you're supposed to do on overwatch? Alright, she might need to be a superhero here. Actually, she already has a flanking shot on this guy. If she kills him, we don't need to worry about our friend. But if she doesn't kill him, she's also going to die. What about this dude right here? Can you just jump through the window? I think he's only in half cover. What about you? What are you shooting at? Oh, you can take out this guy. That's suppressing, that would be really good. 
Thank you. All right, that's a good start. We just have these two left. You'll run up here. You shoot him right in the face. It should give you a promotion. You should kill it, right? Thank you. Now Marcus and Annette have to deal with this guy. I should be able to kill him. Okay, well she didn't kill him, which I would have preferred her to kill him. Let me finish him off. That's fine. Alright. All we've lost is our robot. Which is, you know, it's an unmanned combat vehicle. That's the point is for it to go in dangerous situations and take the shots instead of the human operators. Of course we did lose, it was a financial loss, but that's fine. Kept the human soldiers alive. We've taken out a lot of floaters. There's still more floaters and a muton. That's our first muton opponent. You shooting at seven, six, seven. Come on, emo. Keep up the. Oh, was I keep up the good work? That's bad. We need to get Weber back because they can just move around here and flank him really easily. Thirty-eight. That's not very good. You yeah, probably just suppress that muton. What she's doing. You should. Getting some full cover. Okay, I was gonna say, excuse me, what? Hey, you don't need to kick the door down anymore. They just opened it for you. Very nice of them. And you can't see out, I guess? Okay. Well, whatever, he's in full cover. Might be nice just getting. No, that'd be stupid. I really wish there was better full cover available. Yay. Not very good. Can't take cover behind the destroyed. That's affirmative. Destroyed shiv. Just fall back a little bit. Can you still hit him with a grenade? Oh, it's be really nice to wound him. Better wound our, our muton enemy here. He doesn't tear us up with that plasma rifle. There we go. Good hit. A or suppression. You can't see anything for some reason. Now it's just our gunner. What does she want to shoot at? I really want to take the kill. Let's be greedy. Didn't pay off. You don't say. We got some Overwatch shots. Missed. Guy in the house better see this guy. He's right out the door. How are you not seeing him? He's literally right there. Oh, not this nonsense. Get out of here. Well, Julie, looks like you're gonna have a little, a little shootout over here. How can you not see out the door frame? That's really frustrating. Can we cross the door? Now can you see out? No, you can't. I <laughs> don't. This game, line of sight in this game is not, is not perfect. Right, you need to. Uh, you don't really have anywhere good to move here. I just have a little death battle here. Okay. Usually not a good idea. Ah, oh, but it worked out. Good job. You're alive. I guess there's lots of overwatch. Give a bad shot there. I'm tossing our grenade at him. Nope, he's too far away. How can you not see him? What is going on with this line of sight? Alright, it's a wounded floater. Oh, you going to finish off? Arcade? No, you're not. Both on Overwatch. 
He's an opportunist, and you remember that. That's opportunist, so if we shoot. We want to take the Overwatch shot. We start moving up. Headed there now. Reloaded. Have a net. Try flanking them. And he just can't see anything, but who knows why. You know, if you can't see anything from there, let's just move around the side here. That was gross. He kind of drained over that dude's body. There you go at the store next turn. If you shoot, you're going to get overwatched. I don't think overwatch procs on grenade throws, but he can't throw far enough anyway. You can squad sight that guy and take him out. <sighs> Two damage. I was going to not. I was not using the precision crit shot because I didn't think we need it. Apparently, didn't need it. Ah, uh, more floaters. Get out of here. It's bad for her. See, he's not in Overwatch because he shot. 48, 48. She still can't. Why are you so useless? Right there, Arcade. Still only hit that guy. I look take down. Don't have to worry about it. Or miss, that's cool too. Yeah, she's back off. It's her chance. 49 is not very good. Yay, 48, 48. Really don't like that guy being there. Get anywhere helpful yet? Move into position. There you go. 60. What? Defense. How does that stop us from hitting him? Now it's really wounded though. That's good. I think we just need to back off a little bit. Maybe even have a net here back off a lot. Oh no, oh no, oh no, you're dead. Oh, it's not a flanking shot at least. I still hit him and kill him. And he's still alive! It's actually pretty lucky. Now he's gonna run next turn, he did his job. Can we take out this- there we go, can we take out this one health floater already? So now it's- this is one floater and this- Newton, correct? I'm- I'm right about that. And it's on Overwatch, so don't be running around anywhere crazy. F2, uh, that's not very good. No, I shouldn't necessarily be using the sniper for everything like that, because he's already leveled up. I really want some of these hits, it's like this. I just want to kill these guys. Can't see him from there. Okay, arcade. Thank you. Uh, it's too easy to get flanked there. Okay. Still can't see him. You are injured. You just need to uh, get out of there. On the move. Did your job. Like you'd get in this house at some point. Or just over here. Alright, just a mutant left. Just can we take a couple overwatch shots? He seems to be un unperturbed though. Take him out of the grenade. Moving out. To not move where we can get flanked. That's a pretty important rule. 
Yeah, just try kill with the grenade. There we go. Beautiful. That should be everything. Beautiful. Just lost the robot. Not a big deal. Got rid of everything else. Everyone survived. We got some level ups. I assume. And we got at least one on Sniper who killed everything. Which isn't exactly the most efficient way to do it, but it was effective. And everyone got leveled up. Yay! The only, only thing that was destroyed was our robot that got a kill and died bravely. Go on the memorial wall. And you're our sapper. Don't need that. You don't take support grenades. Two arc thrower charges. I don't really like any of these. They all give them mobility. One additional use of support grenades. He doesn't take support grenades because he takes destructive grenades. He's not going to take the arc thrower. So I guess we'll just give him the uh, primary weapons. So when he's not using grenades, he does more damage. Our gunner, yep. More defense. Bonus damage at half health. Increases the area effect of suppression, rockets, proximity mine launchers. Well, she's not a rocketeer. She doesn't have any of those weapons. And she's also not a mech. So it just increases area effect of suppression. Which doesn't really have an area effect, so I guess it will give it a small area of effect. We're gonna just give her more defense. Oh, actually we're gonna give her executioner because it's a lot of stat bonuses. Plus four aim, two will, and mobility. Execution is an alright skill anyway. They shouldn't get that. Bam, way better stats now. Good level up for her. Our sniper emo. Executioner, sharpshooter, or good ground. Don't take good ground. I'm not gonna take it. I'll also give them really good stat bonuses, so I don't think it will. Now nah, it's all zeros across the board. So, 10 aim and crit chance against weakened enemies, or 10 aim and crit chance against covered enemies. We're going to take, we already have a lot of executioner, and our sniper is going to be probably shooting at, because it does a high amount of damage, especially with crits, primarily going to be shooting at tougher targets, so we'll give them a sharpshooter. So I justify that. A net. I really love our infantry, but we keep losing our assaults, because I keep assaulting with the assaults, and the assaults get killed. Don't, we might make her assault, but I'll make sure, see if we have anyone else. Rockets, I'm just not enjoying. I don't think the rockets have been very, very useful at all. So we'll just take more gunners. Rockets are just useless, unreliable, inaccurate, might not even do a lot of damage with damage roulette. So we're just not going to take them. And some good resources, a lot of money, pan decrease. It was a good mission. I'm happy about that mission. A yes, of yeah, we've lost a couple. Taking a couple of casualties. We'll, 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 we'll hire some guys. Yeah, we have zero. Oh, we have one assault. Vladimir Gusev. Who has no will. Wow, Vladimir, you are incredibly cowardly. I guess that grave wound you suffered really messed you up. You have some serious PTSD. I suggest that PTSD makes you cowardly. Be extremely offensive and inaccurate. Where's our infantry? They all they have two infantry and the one gravely wounded assault. Take another assault. They do like assault. What's her aim though? Aim, yeah, her aim's kind of poor. So we'll just make her an assault. Because then aim doesn't really matter because they're going to be right in their face with a shotgun. So it's easy to hit no matter what. We're also going to hire some soldiers. Need get five soldiers. Now, once our fission generator is done, we can build more satellite uplinks to support the satellites we have coming in. We can not at all afford another fighter, but I think we have one on order. Right. We, oh, it's already come in, so we have we need to re give it a name. Boss, nice. Boss Bardoni. That's way better than Dingus. We have Lieutenant Moose. Yeah, so, yeah, Lieutenant Ragman, Lieutenant Spike. So we have. Maybe that's. Should transfer. Maybe you transfer to Asia. And then you. Oops. Transfer to North America. That gets our. Experience spread out to all the continents. 
more evenly. Let's start our scan. New research. So we have our arc thrower. We have to build a couple of those. Experimental warfare. I don't remember what that does. Nine days though. I don't remember what it does. Improved body armor. We can just start building some body armor. That would be good. Build a laser sniper. That would also be great. That would give our genetics program. We don't need that really. What does experimental warfare do again? I just don't remember. Weapon fragments. I mean, we have lasers, we have improved body armor. Get the genetics. Illyrium lets us have a Illyrium generator, at least I remember that. Let's do the body armor, because they have lasers coming. I get tier 2 armor as well. And our satellites are built, can't launch them yet, so I kind of messed up, messed that up with the, the satellite uplinks. Two engineers? Alloys are really valuable though. I actually don't think we need them for engineers. We have our new soldiers in. Fission generator is almost complete. Illyrium's, I don't think he's as valuable, at least not now. So yeah, we can take a couple of engineers for that. Pretty quiet. South Africa wants a satellite. Okay, I'm going to do this. I don't know. We give them a satellite, it actually launches the satellite, or just hands it over to them. So let's see. We do have a quote unquote spare satellite right now. So I just want to see if this actually puts the satellite in their airspace or not. With the extra reward. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Additional uplink required. So so did it not? So we still have two. Okay, so it does launch it. Alright. I wish it was that a little more clear when it first presents that to you in the Long War mod. Because it makes it sound like you just give them the satellite, and then it's just you just lose the satellite for a couple engineers, that would never be worth it. But we need to launch our satellite uplink? Launch? Construct? You know what I'm trying to say. Words. Words can be hard. This is a very quiet been a very quiet week here in XCOM Alien Invasion Land. Finally, we get a small UFO we can take down. Let's send our new our new man, Boss. Let's see how he handles this. We're in pursuit. See if he lives up to the name. It's a scout UFO. You can take it out. Wait a second now. Or you can just get torn apart. Almost died. That was a disappointing performance. Spike can take care of it though. Starts already damaged. Enemy is the spike should be able to finish it off. Alright, got a spike. Got his lieutenant. There you go. Good job, lieutenant. And it died. We don't need to do a mission for it. No, alloys are important right now. Scientists would be nice though. Oh, we get a report card? Or is it a special mission? Special mission. A lot of money, some scientists panic reduction. Oh, the bomb disposal mission. Uh oh. That's a hard mission. It's not super hard. It's not super easy. If we send the A team, they might not come back. If we send a B team, they almost certainly won't come back, so we'll be able to complete the mission. So it's gonna be a high risk mission, because if we fail the mission, the bomb explodes, everyone dies. I mean you have a chance to get back to the, the dropship, but I mean there's a good chance they're still enemies around shooting at you, you might not make it. It'll be a high-risk mission, but we'll save that for next episode. Thanks for joining me. Subscribe for more. Follow me on Twitter. You know the deal. I'll see you next time.